Hi guys, welcome to Wednesday the 13th of May. So what we're going to do today for the warm-up is we're going to do three rounds. We're going to start off by doing 15 leg swings each leg. We'll then go 15 side to side and then we'll go 15 good mornings. Once you guys have completed three rounds, you will then complete 50 lunges. Okay, it will be 25 each leg. So to show you the movements, if you guys need help, hold on to a wall or something, you're basically just going to swing your leg nice and high, okay? Change legs. And then the sideways one, holding on to your wall. Try to go nice and high. Okay, and then the last one will be the body weight. Good morning. So with this here, yeah, make sure that you guys roll your shoulders back. Keep your back nice and flat and shift the hips back, okay? Then you're going to move on to the 50 normal um, lunges, and this is what they'll look like. And you'll go 25 each leg, okay? Next thing we're going to do for the strength is this needs to be weighted, so you guys can use your backpacks. This is what the good morning will look like. Okay, so exactly the same as the warm-up, except now we've put in the weight on. All right, um, and then the weighted glute bridges will look like this. Okay, so make sure that you guys squeeze the hips as much as you can and try to get them off the, the floor as high as you can. Then what we're going to do today is we're doing Max's hit session. So for the first movement, we, what we're doing is we're doing eight rounds. For the first movement, we're going to be doing um, the speed skaters. And um, then the next thing we're going to do is 12 box uh, dips. We'll then do 12 jumping squats and 12 V-ups. Okay. So the first thing is um, try to get the movement right first. And then what I would suggest is if you guys have two water bottles, Fill them up with water and try to do the first movement with water bottles. I will show you what the movement looks like with weight, but first, this is what the movement looks like. And if I add in the weight, it makes it a lot more challenging. So I've got little plates, just going to hold it in this position. So if you guys can, if you've got little weights at home, use them. If not, grab water bottles um, and fill them up with water. It will make it a lot more challenging if you're holding um, two objects. Okay, next movement is the box dips. So this is what the box dip will look like. You guys can use chairs or whatever it is that you guys have. Remember with this movement, make sure that you get the elbows back and keep them in. Okay, then uh, we're going to move on to the jumping squats. So make sure with the jumping squats that you're getting your hips nice and low, push the knees out and keep your chest upright. The last one will be the V-up. Okay, so with the V-up, you want to come up, make sure you're getting the shoulders off the ground, you're going to meet in the middle. We're doing eight rounds of that. Enjoy the workout, guys. We'll see you tomorrow.